Hi, it's Grandma Roseanne. We're going to have fun time right now. We are going to make milkshakes and chocolate malt and strawberry malt. So what is not to love about this video? Okay, we're going to start out with ice cream. I'm going to make the milkshake first. Now, I'm using vanilla bean. Use whatever you like. Okay, and if you want a chocolate milkshake, use chocolate ice cream. Strawberry milkshake, strawberry ice cream. So whatever you want. I'm putting about three healthy scoops in there. And then I have one cup of milk. And we are going to mix it up. Now understand the longer you mix this, the more liquefied it will become. Okay? Okay, here we go. <laughs> never get that thing off on of the first time not ever and I've had that thing for years is there anything prettier than an old-fashioned glass to do this in now just watch this Ooh. perfect all right we did good our first milkshake now for our next delight, it's going to be a strawberry malt. And what I love about this is that you can make it as flavorful as you want to make it. Sometimes they chip you in these stores or these restaurants, but here you can do whatever you want and make it as wonderful as you want. I have three scoops of ice cream in there. I only have a half a cup of milk because I want it to be pretty thick. I'm going to put in one. I just have the Nestle's malted milk. Um, there's a lot of different malted milks that you can buy. I think this one is just pretty darn good. And you want one heaping tablespoon. And again, to your liking. So if you want it to have more malt flavor, add more malt. And strawberries. And this is what I love because I want to taste the fruit. So, jillions of strawberries right there. Now I'm going to give it a little taste test because right now we can make all kinds of corrections if we need to. I think it needs more ice cream. More ice cream can't hurt anything. <laughs> that should do it. Now my next little glass. Perfect. Whoa, look at that. I love it when a plan comes together. And then for our last family favorite, chocolate, a chocolate malt. Whoa. Now, can you just imagine movie night at your house and you're serving this to all of those little guys? They would love it. So I've got, again, malted milk, at the malt and a half a cup of milk and of course we have to have the chocolate i'm using nestle's but use whatever you like all right here we go look at how nice and thick that is oh so good oh my goodness no adjustments required there. Now what I did is I got our fountain glass and I just rimmed it with chocolate, let it run down the sides, pour it in. And 
we have a work of art. <laughs> Isn't it delicious? All right, give me a minute. Is this just like an appetizer delight for anybody who loves ice cream? I think it's amazing. So we have our milkshake right here. We have our strawberry right there and the chocolate. Now, now I obviously cannot eat all three, so I'm gonna go for the one that I love the most and that's gonna be the chocolate. Just look at that. Get over there. Oh, that's really good. It's really nice and thick, malty. But I don't know you guys, I really am a lover of strawberry. I love the fresh fruit. I really do. Well, we just can't leave that one alone. I mean, come on. That would not be fair. So, a milkshake with a cherry. It would be hard to pick a favorite. <laughs> it really would. So anyway, just know, add your flavors. You can have different ice cream flavors. You can have different fruit flavors. Whatever you want, entirely up to you. So if you had fun with us, like we have fun with you, come back, come back. Hit subscribe, because that makes, that makes us really happy. And um, hit, the, hit the little bell. And then I will leave some ingredients below for you, okay? So thank you, have a nice evening, bye. Enjoy this if you use it for movie time, bye.